What's going on folks? Hobo Handliner here. I'm here at a nice little creek. It's supposed to be overcast and stormy a little bit um, with some rain. So I'm gonna tripod mount my camera underneath my jacket so it doesn't get wet because it's not waterproof. But I wanna get my waders on and actually get in the creek and see if these trout are biting on flies. If not, we'll use worms. Um, there's a big Palomino trout in there. I don't know if you guys saw that. The trout just hit the surface. Um, they do stalk this three times a year, um, and they put big palomino in here. So I just want to catch a stringer full of fish, but if we can catch a palomino, that would be awesome. So stay tuned. Let's get rigged up, and I'm going to wait on out there, see if we can catch some trout. Check it out guys, fishing in the rain paid off. Absolutely gorgeous rainbow here. He's got someone else's line in his mouth too, but fat, healthy, strong. Come on buddy, let me get you. Get you up to the camera, okay. He's bleeding out of his gills, so it's just as well that we're keeping them. Oh my goodness, he is, oh, that is a strong rainbow. He got a big mouth full of my fly. Great rainbow. He hit it like a ton of bricks. So we're going to keep him, throw him on the stringer. I got all my gear hiding under my rain jacket, so I'm getting wet, but at least my phone and my stuff is protected. So let's get him on the stringer. Keep going. These fish are real fired up with this rain, and they're definitely chasing flies. I missed a bunch of bites, but geez, he's fired up. Anyways. Good fish. Nice, fat, good fish. Let's keep going. All right, guys, I got a bunch more nibbles on the fly, but now they've stopped biting it. So I'm going to switch over to a worm rig and see if we can get any uh, on that. If not, it might be a one and done kind of situation. I'm absolutely soaked, but uh, we're not going to give up. See if we can get another one on the worms.
switched over to that worm rig. Got a nice little uh, little creek chub here. I might not get any more trout, so it could be that I finish the day just catching these little guys. But as long as I get some action, you know. Um, I went to a much deeper leader too. I know the creek chubs like to hang out at the bottom. So if that's all I get, oh well. Let's let this little guy go. We'll keep going. Another one about the same as the last guy, about five inches, four or five, four or five inches. So we'll just keep going until I feel like quitting or my battery dies. Uh, getting a little cold. This rain has got me completely soaked, but we're going to keep going. I'm not, I mean, it's about 60 degrees, so I think I'm okay. No risk of hyperthermia or anything. I just can't seem to get away. It's the end of my weekend. I gotta keep going, you know? Creek chub number three, they're definitely fired up, but I mean, they're greedy little pigs, so <laughs> no surprise there. I don't think I've ever had bad luck fishing for creek chubs. They're always hungry. Let's keep going. Number four, they're getting smaller in size. Let's see if I can get something bigger. Come on, buddy, get off that hook. There we go. Let's see if I can get a bigger one. Hey, if I was fishing for live bait to use for bass or something, or catfish, these things would be awesome. Pretty much every cast I'm catching creek chubs. My dexterity has gone down a little bit because I'm getting a little cold, but it's number five. We're going to keep going. a little bit bigger let's say we got these uh, chubs dialed in for sure about 20 inches down they're eating the worms we'll keep going Number six, I think. I don't know, I'm starting to lose track. I think that was number six.
number seven another little guy real little let's uh keep on going we'll probably be uh probably be done soon There's another one, probably the smallest one yet. We're gonna go a little longer, see if we can catch one decent sized one. But then I'm gonna call it quits, go home, get cleaned up, dry it off, and edit this video for you guys. Let's catch one more, one more fish. There we go guys, last fish of the day. Not a ton of action on the trout, some bites, mostly these creek chubs, but I'm um, gonna wrap it up. I gotta work tomorrow, getting up at 3.30 in the morning. Gonna get home, get cleaned up, eat some dinner, all that good stuff. So let's finish off our weekend with that little guy right there. And uh, I'll give you guys a shot of this trout. All right guys. We're packing it up for the day got our nice beautiful rainbow trout there you see that line that's that other other person's line i was talking about that was already in him so someone i think was using power bait or something um but he was a feisty little guy i am glad we got our one trout um yeah probably the first time i've actually come out here and gotten soaking wet in a creek just to make a video for you guys so anyways hope you guys enjoy it there's that uh there's that fish one more time. I'm the Hobo Handliner, guys. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And I'll uh, see you in the next video. Thanks.